Hey love, so this hair is by Baby Doll Luxury Hair. Unfortunately, I accidentally deleted the first portion of this video, just showing the unboxing, packaging, and hair. But as you see here, I do have some pictures just to show you guys. This is like some really beautiful hair. They did send me their natural way, Brazilian with the closure in 16, 14, 12 inches, along with a 12 inch closure. I'm gonna tell you guys this, I am amazed by this hair. I did use this box dye right here, which you will see in the video, but I absolutely love it. And unfortunately I did delete the beginning, but I hope you guys still really enjoy this video. Okay, you guys, so let me tell y'all something because first of all, um, I'm shooting this video right now, the day before I go to New York to do the RPG show meet and greet. Now, let me tell y'all, they sent me a wig to wear to the meet and greet and it was very like brassy. It was just like really, I tried to tone it, it didn't come out. So, you know, I was like, okay. Meanwhile, in between time, while I tone this, I'm also going to go ahead and dye my unit from Baby Doll Luxury Hair. You know what I'm saying? Because I wanted to see how it lifted, how it worked. Now, first of all, the tracks on the the tracks from Baby Doll Luxury Hair were not as long as like the tracks you would get from like AliExpress or anything like that. Like they were not as long, but they were very acceptable. Like I had only three bundles and I didn't um, space them so close this time. They were a little bit further spaced apart, which was fine because the hair is still really full and it's a natural wave. But you know, I did use a different dome cap. I mean, I, I I used the same exact spandex mesh dome cap that I normally use, but this time I used an extra large. I wanted to see how the extra large dome caps fit, so I bought a pack of, like, three of them just to see how they would fit. And they're very roomy, roomy so if you have a lot of hair or your head is just above average size, then they definitely will work. But for me, they were a little bit too big, so I did have to kind of, like, sew the wig in. But let me tell you guys something. This hair is like the bombest ass hair I have yet to experience. Like for real, I'm gonna tell y'all exactly why. So, okay, so like a few weeks ago, like a couple of weeks ago, y'all did see that I posted up a video that I had went ahead and I had um, dyed the hair. I used box dye. Now I used the exact same box dye for this particular hair. You know what I'm saying? But the only thing with Baby Doll Luxury hair is it lifted like, a million times better. I've never seen results like this with box dye. Um, you know, normally I do like a lot of the hair from like um, China, like um, AliExpress or like their own sites. And that hair does process well too. It, like it does take to hair dye very well also. But I've never seen the color lift like the way it has on this hair from Baby Doll Luxury Hair. So when I seen this, I was like, oh dang, I should have really recorded this. I wish I would have recorded it because um, the method that I did, I mean, it was the same method that I normally do, but I just I did do a little bit different this time. You know what I'm saying? Um, I sectioned it the same, but the way that I painted on the dye was totally different, and I wish I would have recorded it for you guys, but I was in such a rush because I didn't like the wig that I had initially received to wear to this event. It was like not not to my expectations and I wasn't going to wear it. So I wanted to finish this one and see if I could wear this instead. Even though I have like a bunch of wigs in my closet, I really wanted to see how this one came out. Girl, let me tell y'all. Okay, so first of all, I used two boxes of this right here. This is the Dark and Lovely and this is the Luminous Blonde. Okay, so I used the Luminous Blonde. Y'all did see I used the Luminous Blonde in a prior video um, and I only used it in the frontal and this is I got a darker color um, from it because I don't really know why but I mean the hair quality is good on that hair too but totally different vendors so I used two boxes into this um, and not even two full boxes there was probably like a little tiny bit left a little bit left so I just saturated more of the hair with it but this is all that I used two boxes of this after the wig was made you know what I'm saying so I made the wig first and I had it on my mannequin head and that's when I started to paint the wig you know like you use the actual you know the dye brush the hair brush that you use to you know bleach your hair brush on or whatever process your hair I use that so girl let me tell y'all i am like in love with this wig i wanted to show you guys show you guys what it looks like because i'm about to go curl it and you know i don't really curl on camera because it just takes too long like it's very very lengthy um and i just can curl it a lot better versus it being on myself so okay look at this hair 
Do y'all see this? Like, for real though, the color in this is like, what? This color, I mean, it probably look even better. It looks to me, it looks better on in person. But this is bomb ass hair. Like, I have never gotten any hair and and dyed it with this box dye and it came out to look like this. Never, okay? Never. Ever, 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 ever. This hair is so freaking pretty. I mean, like, the color came out so nice. Um, I'm just, like, amazed that... I really didn't expect this, but... I'm, like, surprised. I'm very, very shocked. Now, for one, I just put on a mannequin head and I pinned the top up. And, you know, I just took section by section, you know, row by row from me sewing it. And I did it like that. Um... And the ends, I, 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 I dyed first. Like, I put a lot more um, concentration or whatever you want to call it, more dye on the ends. And then I just brushed lightly. I just brushed lightly. I took the brush and I kind of, like, raked it in. So that way it wasn't really laying on the actual hair. So at the bottom portion of the hair, I laid the actual dye on. Like, I took the brush and I smeared it. Not smeared it, but, you know like heavy heavily heavily laid it onto the hair and then as i moved my way up i just took the ends of the brush and i kind of like raked it in so that way it wasn't so heavy and concentrated on the hair but this came out so freaking pretty and you know something it didn't even shed at all like i i'm like wow like for real baby doll hair got some bomb ass hair like for real like <sighs> this came out so nice so this is what i'm about to wear um I'm so excited, like, for real, like, I'm so happy about the way this really turned out. Um, this looked like some fall, like, some real autumn leaf colors, you know what I'm saying? Like, for real. So, like I was saying, the wig cap is was a little bit too big, so I just, you know, sewed in the actual wig cap some more. And I did sew my combs in here like normal, so I have three combs. And it came pre-tweezed apart, so I think there is actually, it looks like there's three parts in it, three parts, so... What I'm going to do is I'm going to put some um, concealer and I'm going to just see how it looks prior to me curling it. Because So the one thing that I will need to fix is the part. Because it's a little bit off. So no big deal. Okay, so it was 16, 14, 12 inches. And I think the um the closure was 12 inches too. Okay, listen. Honeys, this color is like for real, I like it so much. The hair is still like really, really soft. Like when I have done other hair with the same box dye, it's a little bit like drier at the ends, but this is still like silky smooth, like smooth to the touch. It's gonna look even prettier once I curl it. So I will be back in a few, or uh, it won't be a few for you guys. I'm just going to fade into it. But I'm going to go curl this now, and we're going to see how it looks. Okay, you guys, so are you ready to do this? I curled it up really nice. This is the way I like to curl it with my wand curler, and I just kind of like twist the hair, kind of like twist it as I'm wrapping it around. These give like the fullest curls. You don't have to cut it. It kind of like blends the hair really cute. Let's get into this video.
right, you guys. So let me tell you, I think this is by far one of my favorite wigs that I have ever made. Like seriously, like I love the way the color came out. I like the length of it. I like the way I curled it. I like the way it goes on my makeup, my skin complexion. I love everything about this wig. Like for real, hands down. Um, baby doll hair luxury baby doll luxury hair has some really nice hair so definitely check them out um look all i had to use was two boxes of this okay and for real she looking real good so this 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 whole look made me makes me feel like autumn leaves like you know what i'm saying when the leaves fall from the trees they got all those different color browns and oranges and reds in them this looks so much like a fall color so i definitely love this wig it's by far like i said one of my favorites and i'm not really sure if that's a word or not but listen now i'm about to go try on my outfit that i'm going to wear to the event with this hair because i really want to get the feel of everything and plus i gotta put on these daggone heels that's one thing that i'm not really too excited about but for the most part, this hair really held up. Like I said, the tracks are not as long as like I was expecting them to be. Especially because most of the time, the hair that I get is basically from China. Um, like out of 100%, I would say like 95% or 90% of the time, the hair that I normally review is from China. And there's nothing wrong with their hair either. It works just as well. It's really good quality hair too. But I have never seen any of the hair lift like this. So this by far is like an amazing transformation from just using box dye. So definitely check them out. And it didn't even shed not one bit while I was washing it and when I rinsed it out. So that was like girl what i was really really shocked about that um for the most part because normally i do get some shedding but not a one strand so definitely check them out um i will post all of their information for you girls below and on that note let me know what you think of this one i will definitely definitely make sure to put some pictures in or post them on instagram of me wearing my entire outfit in new york with this fabulous hair so i love you guys make sure you rate comment subscribe thumbs this video up because you love me so much and make sure you check out baby doll luxury hair because they got some bomb ass hair so i love you and i'll see you soon